I asked an AI to make a new Dragon Ball Saga, and here is what it came up with. To give you guys a heads up, ChatGPT's knowledge is only up to January 2022, so anything after that day, it does not know anything. So it's not aware of Beast Gohan or Orange Piccolo or even the Granola Arc, or any sort of media that Dragon Ball came up with after of January 2022. For the prompt, I asked to create a new Dragon Ball villain that is new and original, describing its backstory and origins and goals, and here is what it came up with. Introducing Xenothrax, an ancient Dragon Ball villain born from the remnants of shattered dimensions, in a distant realm where time and space converged. An unforeseen cataclysm ruptured the fabric of reality. From this chaos emerged Xenothrax, a being composed of pure energy and the essence of fractured timelines. Driven by a desire for absolute power, Xenothrax's goal is to unravel the very fabric of existence, merging all timelines into a singular chaotic reality under its control. The malevolent entity possesses the ability to manipulate time, distorting events at will, and bending the past, present, and future to suit its whims. And wow, it's a lot to take in. Not only we're dealing with a villain that can manipulate time, but also we're dealing with a time traveler, which is something that is definitely not allowed when your goal is to merge timelines into one. But before I ask if Whis or Beerus or even Zeno is stepping in, I asked what the character looks like. Xenothrax is a colossal entity. Its form, a shifting maelstrom of ethereal energies woven together with strands of distorted time. Its body is reminiscent of a dragon, serpentine coils of luminous energy that intertwine and pulsate with temporal power. The dragon-like silhouette is both majestic and fearsome, adorned with fractured crystalline scales that shimmer with the colors of fractured timelines. So basically, we're dealing with a dragon that can manipulate time. So after that, I asked if any of the guys are stepping in in this one, and it may surprise you. Beerus and Whis, aware of the monumental clash between Blank and Xenothrax, choose to observe from the sideline. Recognizing the unprecedented threat posed by Xenothrax, Beerus considers intervening, but Whis advised against it, emphasizing the importance of mortal growth and self-resolve in the face of cosmic challenges. As the battle escalates to cosmic proportions, the Omni King Zeno takes notice. Initially indifferent, Zeno becomes intrigued by the cosmic ripples caused by Blank's transformation and Xenothrax's temporal chaos. However, rather than directly intervening, Zeno opts to watch the interest, allowing the outcome to unfold naturally. Aside from Beerus, the gods never considered intervening, but are intrigued of how the outcome would result in, which is very surprising, so who is fighting this potential universal threat? I ask which fighter is going to contest with Xenothrax, is it someone we recognize from within the Z-team or is it someone from another universe? It gave us Vegito. Vegito's unparalleled combat skills combined with the versatility of Super Saiyan Blue form make him a formidable foe capable of challenging Xenothrax's reality-bending powers. The clash between the two creates a spectacle that transcends the boundaries of space and time. I was really surprised with that answer. I was honestly hoping someone like Hit to get a chance to show off his abilities more, so uh, I asked AI if there's a twist in this battle and how does it go? It said, Indeed, as the battle between Vegito and Xenothrax reaches its climax, an unexpected twist unfolds. Sensing the overwhelming power of Xenothrax, Vegito taps into a latent potential with a fusion, a fusion beyond the known limits. In a surge of energy and determination, Vegito transcends into a new transformation, Omni Saiyan. This transformation goes beyond the confines of Super Saiyan Blue, incorporating the essence of both Goku and Vegito's experiences and power. Vegito becomes a being of unprecedented might, a fusion that resonates with the very fabric of the Dragon Ball multiverse. So now we have a new transformation that only Vegito can tap into, which is a really cool take on the fusion warriors. I immediately ask what it looks like, and it's said that it retains its signature spiky Super Saiyan style hair, but it takes on a shimmering, iridescent hue that shifts through spectrum of colors, symbolizing the fusion with the cosmic force at play. That sounded really cool and really extra, so now we got a Dragon Ball villain, a Vegito fight, and a new transformation that would be really cool to make it canon. So I asked what the title of the saga would be called, it said the Temporal Reckoning Saga, and that concludes our AI journey. What do you guys think about this saga? Would you tune in for this if this was animated? And would you guys want a fully fleshed out story about this? Subscribe for a free cookie and thank you guys so much for a thousand subscribers. I really don't know what else to say or do, maybe a Q&A? Anyways, I'll see you guys on the next one, and peace.